Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. Yes, with our last break of 2018 Topps Stadium Club Baseball, four-box random team number eight from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Big thanks to all of these folks right here for getting into the action. There are your combo teams here. I think we threw out some teams as well. We may, uh, yeah, Pirates, Rays, Rangers, and Rockies are, are not in this set. Um, we'll do a randomizer for that just in case some inserts or variations pop out of there. We'll, uh, so we'll send it to one person in the break. All right, so let's randomize each list, names and teams, four and a one, five times for each list. One, two, three, four, and a one, five times. After five times, we've got TJ on the pole and Rory in the 23 spot. 23, Jordan. Four and a one, five times for the teams. One, two, three, four. Four and a one. Five times. After five times, we've got the Mariners Blue Jays combo down to the Tigers Padres combo. All right, so TJ with the Mariners Blue Jays combo. Mario with the Last Bond Mojo Yankees. Nick K with the O's. Joseph G with the Marlins. Ben, you got the Royals. Mary with the Red Sox. Paul Cool Whitlock with the A's. Ryan, you have the Mets. TJ with the Astros. Joseph G, Diamondbacks. Manny with the Indians. Ryan with the Reds. Kike Hernandez with the Cardinals. Logan with the Phillies. Mary Lou with the Nationals. Amber, you got the Cubs. Chris, you got my Dodgers. Amber with the Giants, Joe with the uh, Joe Fagundes, that is, with the White Sox, couple Joes in this break. Loden, you got the Brewers and Twins combo. Seth with the Braves, Joe Fagundes with the Angels, and Rory with the Tigers-Padres combo. Let's sort by team. Any trades? Looking in the chat here. Any trades? Also, if you're just joining us, it appears as if our building is doing some fire alarm testing, so apologies beforehand if... Uh, if it goes off, it's over there. It's really loud. All right. Any trades? I'll give it a couple more seconds here. Ah, see, there it is, right on cue. There's no fire department, ladies and gentlemen, so usually when that happens, our fire department's Johnny on the spot here. It sounds like it's maintenance. All right. Trade window closed, TWC. Let's print and rip. Here we go. Random Team 8, Stadium Club Baseball. Oh, come on. It was quiet for so long. The list remains the same. Oh, there it is. See? It heard me. All right, I'm going to have to call that company after this break, ladies and gentlemen, see, see what's going on. All right. I'll keep you updated in the next break. Um, box number one. One of four. Our last four boxes, Stadium Club. Thanks, everybody, who... Uh, who helped us work through a bunch of these breaks. Two on-card autographs per box. There you go, on average. All right, good luck, boys and girls. Always love... We haven't done Stadium Club in a minute or two, but a lot of great photography, a lot of unique photography. I think a lot of photos that we have not seen before. On-card autos are always nice. Got some nice parallels in here too. So there's that parallel kind of parallel hunt. Sorry about that alarm, folks. We'll, we'll, we'll look into it after this break. Okay. All right, here we go. 
So you've got cool photography like this. I'm a fan of this set. So like stuff like this, that red Nick Williams will ship. Most of you know by now. There's Manny Machado on my Dodgers now. Crazy. I don't. I don't. I don't think. I don't. Th I think a lot of people in LA didn't really think it was actually gonna happen. I think a lot of people are like, yeah, it'd be nice, but our our front office mo hasn't really been to move prospects, and certainly not for. You know, not move that many prospects, but we did. So I, I think people were kind of amazed. Didn't really believe it until, until we saw him in, in Dodger blue. Tyler Wade is your autograph. That goes to Mario and the Yankees. Last spot mojo strikes again. We'll have these nice oranges sent out to... Now, do they? I just passed by Bryce Harper. Do they try trade Bryce Harper, ladies and gentlemen? If the Nationals are down, let's say the Nationals are seven, eight, ten games behind in in two weeks by the trading deadline. Maybe even less than that now. About about a week. Do you consider it? You can always try to re-sign him. You can always be like, hey, we're gonna get prospects for you, Bryce. And we're still going to gun hard to resign you in free agency. Nice Jack Flaherty, rookie auto. For the Cardinals, that'll go to uh, Kike Hernandez with the Redbirds. Right, a week. It's, it's really close. I actually kind of snuck up on me. Seth saying not yet, just speculation. Well, no, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I've heard the speculation too. But should they is what I'm asking. The Dirt says, yes, please, please get rid of him. As a Nationals fan, get rid of him. So you're over it. I mean, they're going to – I mean, it's either that or they they may lose him in free agency for, for nothing, right? A draft pick? For that free agent, uh, for the if he signs with another team, Nationals get a get a compensatory pick, but that's it. Seth said, I would trade, 100%. I, I, I think, I think it's, it's, it's interesting. I mean, listen, you have Juan Soto. You have, you know, Victor Robles is still in the minors. And Victor Robles is supposed to be, you know, you've, we've seen a lot of his autographs in these sets, in these recent Topps baseball sets. Victor Robles should be like the next big deal. Like, this could be like Ronald Acuna, Albius style big deal. You know, so if you have both Juan Soto and Victor Robles, and Juan Soto's already performing, you know, maybe that softens the blow of, of missing out on Bryce Harper and you get a return. Orioles got a decent return for Manny Machado, so that might be sort of the, the benchmark of what you can maybe expect. So, Dirt saying, yeah, get a lot for the money that you want. Someone who, yeah, you want someone who hustles, isn't a drama queen, someone who has a better strikeout to hit ratio. And you've seen Robles in person. Soto, but with speed. There, isn't, isn't Soto already kind of quick? So, I mean, Robles is supposed to be the real deal. So why not just say, get something for Bryce, call up Robles, and just... Go, go from there to see what happens. There's Sean Newcomb. And what's happening is that the A's and Phillies have really jumped out unexpectedly up front, which has kind of put a damper on the Nationals this season. Everyone's expecting the Nationals to 
to run away with that division. There's my boy Chris Taylor, CT3, for the Dodgers. That'll be for Chris Parent and my Dodgers. Nice one, Chris. Dodgers looking good. Though I think they'll be battling with the Diamondbacks right to the end. That's going to be an exciting finish. You'll see me uh, argue with Arthur and, uh, and Joe P. a lot <laughs> in September. So stay tuned for that. 14 out of 25, Vizel Garcia for the White Sox. That's a nice one for Joe Fagundis. I always like this picture of uh, of Dustin Pedroia with that oversized glove. That always cracks me up. There's Ted Williams. See, that's a great shot right there. And Alex Mejia for the Cardinals. That's another one for... Uh, Kike Hernandez. There you go, Kike. Wait, shouldn't shouldn't you be playing a baseball game right now, Kike Hernandez? I thought I got no, not no. It's three nothing already for the Dodgers. Dodgers still need that bullpen help. I guess I was asking everybody last weekend what like who their favorite team is. And we'll do it again. Who's your favorite team, and what do they think? What do you think they need in the trading deadline? If uh, if you're in contention for a playoff spot, a lot of people are saying bullpen, and I guess that's the that's the real demand, right? You know, I, I had Astros fans saying bullpen. Dodgers definitely need bullpen. The Indians address their bullpen needs with Brad Hand. All right, next box. So it sounds like bullpen. TJ says Dodgers get Zach Britton in there. Could be nice. It just might happen. But I think that's like the, the, the kind of next big step for, uh, for the Dodgers. And, for, and for, for a lot of teams, to be honest with you. So it's going to be a real uh, a real battle between a lot of teams. Man, a week. I, I, the week went by so fast. I was like... It's already a week to the to the trading deadline, ladies and gentlemen. Today is the 24th. And we've got exactly a week from today. The 31st is next Tuesday. So by next week, I think we'll have a good idea of what happens at the, by the end of the non-waiver trading deadline. And then there's the waiver trading deadline where sometimes you can see some big deals by the end of August. Where it's just the waiver trading deadline. A little bit different, but still still deals to be made. But most of the blockbuster deal seems to happen by the 31st. All right. Okay, good luck, everybody. There's Julio Urias, who's starting to throw off the mound. So you might... Have to dust off his rookie cards or his prospect cards. There's Wade Boggs, Black Foil. We'll set those aside. And there's our autograph. Nice. Sean Newcomb autograph. Who's been strong for the Braves. Seth. Seth Toller with the Braves. Nice, Seth.
There's Lance McCullers, orange foil for the Strohs. Um, oh, sorry, I missed that. Um, is case seven the last? No, it's not. Or no, yes, it is the last one. So buy your teams before they all, before they go away. Forty out of fifty power zone. Josh Donaldson. That will go to the Blue Jays Mariners combo for TJ. Oh, nice, Seth. Seth was like, I'm a Braves fan, and I was going to buy this card last week. No need to anymore, Seth. I got you. You're covered. And there's Greg Allen for the Tribe. Manny with that one. Mike Trout. Got some nice black and white photos there, too. All right. Final box in break number eight. Final box of our last break of Stadium Club Baseball. Good luck, everybody. Two more autographs to go. Yeah, indeed it is, Gila. I'll be looking into that fire alarm after the after the break, see what's going on. There's a customer service phone number that I'm going to call. Be like, hey, when's this going to stop? Yeah, we do think it's uh, it's it's probably just a test or something like that. It's been kind of going for like the last hour. <laughs> So maybe maybe they can reveal if it's something that we just have to prepare ourselves to deal with the entire night, or if it's going to end soon. All right, break number eight, folks. Good luck. Last break of Stadium Club Baseball. Thanks for getting into it. We've got other baseball in the store, so check it out on jazbeeshobbyland.com. That's right, Gilo. The building can't handle the heat that I'm pulling. Maybe that's what it is. So it's the, the smoke coming from my hands. All right, last box. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. We did pull that nice Brock Bozer out of five earlier. Yeah, see, the fire alarm knows it too. He's like, I know. It's over $1,000 in that from that hockey break. It's Bob Gibson. Nice. That's a great shot of him too. Black foil. And our autograph is Cam Gallagher. Rookie auto for the Royals. That'll be for Ben. All right. There's Gary Sanchez. A little controversy around him not hustling. Last night, but I get, but maybe it was his groin issue. He's on the DL again. Yankees kind of faltering a little bit. There's Nick Castellanos. They're actually on MLB Network right now playing the Rays. Expecting a, one more autograph out of here. Marcelo Zuna for the Redbirds, black foil. And there's our second auto. It's for the Mets, Philip Evans. Rookie auto for the Mets. That'll be for Ryan. Ryan Shipley with that one.
And that should be it, folks. Let's just kind of breeze through these to see if there's any maybe uh, parallels or inserts that we may have missed. It's a nice shot of Marion or Rivera. That's really cool. That'll ship. And looks like, oh, and another autograph. Bonus auto. Wow, Frank Thomas? The fire alarm going off, knowing that we just pulled some heat. Four out of 25, Frank Thomas. That's our third bonus autograph out of 2018 Stadium Club Baseball. And that was like the, the third or fourth to last card of this box. White Sox. Who got randomized the White Sox? Joe Fagundis. Randomize the White Sox with the Lone Star signatures. Frank Thomas this is the first one of these we've ever seen. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for breaking with us, jazbeeshobbyland.com, where this kind of magic happens. Well, it was only sixteen ninety nine a spot. There you go, jazbeeshobbyland.com, the place to be for more heat like this. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye bye.